Finley High School won their first football game in 1899, beating Ada 13-6. Last week, the Trojans became just the 26th school in the state of Ohio to win 600 football games. 601 coming tonight on the road, 41-7 over Clay. I had a nice talk with the former coach Cliff Height tonight, who was at the Corey Rossing game. Well, speaking of numbers, Austin Scott has this week's Leifeld Welding Top 5 Plays. Van Wert's Colin Smith leads off this week's countdown on the road at Shawnee. Smith has the elusiveness cranked up to 99 on this play. With the quarterback keeper, he jukes out of the frame, breaking numerous tackles on his way to a 36-yard Cougars touchdown. The Delphus Jefferson cheerleaders get onto the top five for the second straight week as their Jeff Cats host Allen East. Jay Stockwell lobs to Brennan Hour over the middle. Hour puts a pair of Mustang defenders on skates and goes into the end zone for a 45-yard touchdown. Watch again as Hour gives a little how do you do. Cavalier fans living it up with a megaphone in the bleachers while the Cavaliers are living it up on the field for our third play this week. Jack Hamilgarn slings it to Aaron Harlemer on the far side and you have to see this catch again. Harlemer twists in midair and brings the ball in with one hand for the touchdown. I know Matt Finkel really loved that catch. Another Matt Finkel nomination gets runner up this week. Salinas Caleb Hoing back to pass on third and 14. He chucks it up for Zach Marks in the end zone and he comes down with it. Here's the lynch dent replay if you will. Marks holds on to the catch even after taking a people's elbow from OG's Kyle Verhoff. Bluffton's Mitchell Alt may be on the sideline, but the Pirates still have plenty of excitement at the quarterback position on this week's top play. Fourth and 20, and Bluffton's going for it. Brett Rumor at quarterback. Great job by the big guys up front holding their blocks, giving Rumor plenty of time. Finally, he looks to the end zone, airs it out to Sam Chris for the touchdown. Arg! Fire the cannon, me mateys. Bluffton makes Paulding walk the plank for a 34-10 victory. Hopefully the Panthers can right the ship. All right, that's all I got. We really appreciate Layfeld Welding coming aboard with us and check back next week for another edition of the Top 5 Plays.